Hey, check it out. I wanted to share this cool project. Turns out when you put magnets in this checkerboard pattern, you can levitate a piece of graphite. Pretty amazing. It's called pyrolytic graphite. Really pure, really brittle, really light. I'll spare you the scientific details, but it floats. I made a frame for it so it wouldn't spill off the sides. Really slippery movement. Incredibly fluid. Almost like air hockey. That gives me an idea. I broke the pattern in the back of the goals so the puck sticks when you score. Let's give it a try. Let me show you how I made it. First, you have to mark one side of all the magnets. North or south, doesn't matter. Then, you have to line them up in a zigzag pattern, stacking them up, back and forth, as wide as you want. So here's an eight by eight grid. As you can see, it's one row of north, one row of south, alternating. But we have to separate the rows and restack them one more time to get this checkerboard. You can do it with a credit card, but it's tricky. Or you can build a slicer from scrap wood. I'm going to carefully slice the rows this way and restack them face up. I stick them down to a piece of metal to keep them in place. Well, there it is. We're ready for levitation. Let's try it out. Hey, it's working. Now we just have to figure out how to make the roads, the magnets, and the cars out of graphite. Thanks for watching.